Drogon, I am coming to feed you. This is a large piece of agatized wood that I found a while back. And I got a cut or two out of it, but I wanted to make lots of cuts because it was really pretty. So I glued it to the wood so I could make it a lot easier. But wait till you guys see this. If you don't remember, this wood is beautiful. Okay, so this is how I have it set up. I'm gonna start out small, make a few cuts, and then we'll get to the larger slabs. Okay, this is just the end, just the end, so I need to keep going. All right. So here is first real slab of pretty agatized wood. I'm going to keep going. Wow, look at this beauty. Oh my. Look at all the detail and colors in this. Gosh, ah, look at this side. Ah, oh, look at that. Color popping right out. Oh, this side's even better. Okay. I think I'm gonna just keep this base and just stop, stop making any more slabs for right now, but I'm really liking this. The common opal or the opalized part of this agatized wood, it fluoresces green. So my rock hounding friend Randall sent Drogon so many crazy lace, Laguna lace agates to cut huge, huge pieces. And I am so excited to feed him these guys. I've been waiting for a little bit. Today is the day. Just have a look at this first one, okay? Hold on. I mean, what? Look at this. <gasps> this is seven and a half pounds. Lots of color going on. Look at that pocket. I would like to see if I can cut this across here, across this face. Hopefully keep, keep some of this druzy. The way that this kind of those indents down. Don't think I'm gonna be able to salvage all of that druzy pocket because I've got to kind of cut it a little bit thicker to get get all the way across. But I still think it's gonna be really pretty. Okay, so Drogon is fighting me on this 
and I've had to readjust to kind of get through it, but this is really pretty. I've got some parallax shadow banding, it looks like, up on the top there. The light kind of makes, makes the banding look like it's moving. I really like all the wavy, plumy stuff around where that mo where that quartz pocket was. The other half of this that came off, this looks totally different. Take a look at this entire guy. I really like this top part. Really different. I really like this piece that Randall sent because it's very agate and very colorful. So I'm gonna make a few cuts because I'd like to eventually get get it straight down the center, but it's a little little wavy, so we'll have to make a few cuts I think before we'll get a nice long straight cut. But I think that this banding is gonna be out of this world, especially over here with all these colors. Okay, get it, Drogon, get it! Okay, let's do the reveal. <gasps> oh, look at that banding. Oh, and it has, oh, look at that plumy colors. Oh, yeah. Let's keep going. Okay, I think this is gonna be really great. Oh, yes it is. Look at that. It's, it has this really nice green, it's like green and lavender to it. Green and purple. Really pretty, look at this banding right here. Wow. Well, look at this side. A beautiful slab, beautiful. This looks very multicolored in the banding and throughout throughout the rock look at this side I really like this going up here so I'm gonna cut it across here I do like this side as well so I'll probably do multiple cuts maybe across the side and across this this face we'll see how picky Drogon is Okay, I've cut off a few slabs, but I haven't really looked at them. Oh, look how colorful that is. That yellow, orange, red, purple, white. Okay, that's great. So now, now that I have Side. Oh, look at this side. Oh, that's so cool. Now that I have this side cut, I'm going to do the front. Okay, 
So I'm gonna pull, push this out a bit so we can cut across the front. Okay, let's take a peek. Good, we got a full slab off. Gosh, look how vibrant that orange red is. So let's take this off the saw and see what it looks like. Okay, so here we go. Here's the side and then around to the front. So when you go to polish it, you can do this side and you can kind of round the edge, curve it around to the front. A nice specimen sitting on a shelf. This is a multi-colored Jasper I found rock hounding. I like this side, it's got a little bit green in there. It's got all the colors. I'm gonna cut across this side. Okay, we'll take a peek inside and then we'll get a slab off. Hey, we're taking a peek at the Montana Jasper. Oh, look at all those colors in there. Red and yellow and peach and like a pink and a red. Let's get another slab. Hey. Oh yeah, look at that yellow against the red and just a, the right amount of green. Fantastic. Oh, this side's even brighter. I love this Jasper. Montana Jasper. Okay, this is a typical, what you would call moss agate or Montana moss agate uh, with green, green moss. And the reason I think that is because I can kind of see some, some green in there. Okay, if I shine my flashlight, you can see it's kind of like a green agatey material. So we're gonna cut it across this front here. I bet it's gonna look really cool inside, especially with light behind it. Okay, got it set up to cut and take a little peek at the inside. See what we have. Hey, let's take a little peek. Oh, look at that green. Okay, that's, that is some insane green. Oh, these are gonna be gorgeous gorgeous slabs oh, okay I'm gonna keep going Let's look for that green oh yeah oh yeah I am just gonna keep making slabs I love this Look at how green and mossy that is. That is your true green moss agate right there. And I'm making these slabs kind of thick. It's like eight, <laughs> eight turns of my, of my hand wheel here. Okay. You can see that green moss. There we go. Okay, I'm just gonna put a light on here so you can see that. See that moss I'm talking about really well. Okay, 
Most people would just walk over this because it looks kind of not great. But if you look really close, it looks like some agaty, jaspery plume potential. So we're going to cut it and see if my instincts are even remotely on with this. <laughs> Sometimes they're not. Okay. Here we go. Okay, I've cut a slab off here. So let's take a look at the end piece here. Oh yeah. Exactly what I was hoping for. This plumy stuff. Oh, I love this stuff. Okay. Ooh, I like this one. Focus in on that. Kind of has more agate going through it. Oh, yeah. So colorful. Wow, look how colorful that one is. Wow. Who knew this all would be inside that rock? Here is another rock or agate that most people would just walk over. I mean, it just looks like black nothingness, nothingness. <laughs> but let's, let's cut it and take a deeper look, maybe with some light. All right. Okay, got the first slab off of here. And let's take a look at it. Ooh, okay, we need, we need some light to accentuate this. Oh, that is nice. Okay, the next slab, oh, such a rich, color deep deep color really see that banding nice and the little baby dendrites Rogan told me he's very, very happy, very well fed. My job's done. So easy. We'll see you on the next feeding. Rock on, everyone.